Hi, good evening. This is Thorn Holder from Dream Development and Designs. And today I would like to speak to you about habits of thinking. One very important habit to include in your process is being coachable, all right? Now, not only coachable within your job, but coachable within life, okay? Um, every situation is an opportunity to learn and grow, especially the ones that you call problems, especially the ones that you deem to be difficult. In there, in those difficult situations lies a gem, a jewel that you could plant a seed, a seed, a beautiful seed. Instead of looking at something as a problem and something that's stressful, look at it as a seed to plant, a seed to, to give you fruits of, of, of enduring riches in, in emotion, spirit, and uh, in the material world. Being coachable allows you to look at every situation differently. You will seldom become stressed or frustrated if you're coachable. Because in every situation that you would have become stressed or frustrated by, you now see an opportunity to be better. You now see an opportunity to learn skills and techniques that will cause you to face this problem at another time and use it to your advantage, okay? You gotta be coachable. Now, in wanting to see any type of change in your life, you must be willing to change the things that you do. A lot of people wanna affect change in their life, but they want to keep the old habits and the old friends and the old methods of thinking. It is not going to work. Everything that you are today is as a result of the things that you were doing three years ago, four years ago, all your life, or even yesterday, okay? So when needing to change something, recognize that um, when, need, when you want some type of change, be ready to change yourself, okay? And do not point fingers. Judging, I've come to realize in anything, any, any sort of judging, as much as it might be obvious that a person is wrong or a criminal or deceptive or whatever, refrain from associating any negative beliefs with them and yourself. So do not look at any situation as bad or negative. If you don't enjoy it, then avoid it. But in your mind, as you look at human beings that you don't live with or that you were not at some point, because I'm sure that you were not me at some point and I was not you. So you really can't look at me or somebody else or anybody and really judge. Okay, so be objective, be optimistic, try to find the good in people. There is good in everybody, everybody. Okay, so in developing uh, excellent habits of thought, it's good to start with the moments of your difficulty. Therein lies opportunities to really grow and become awesome. So you are awesome already. It's all about being more awesome in those challenges, challenging situations and, and sharing your love and your happiness with people as much as you can. It's Thorn Wolf from Dream Designs. It's always a pleasure talking with you. Have a pleasant evening.